This is Sean. I'm on an assessment job today in Greensboro. And what happened here is the basement flooded. And so let me, I'll take you inside and take a look at what happened in there. And then we'll take a look on the outside and see if we can figure out what's going on. So let's take a look. Apparently what happened is we had a bunch of water coming in through here and just flooded everything. The homeowners said that their Wi-Fi went out and when they came down here, their Wi-Fi was pretty much underwater. And so they've had a bunch of fans going, dehumidifiers, and they're working on getting everything dried out in here. So let's take a look outside and see if we can figure out what's going on. Let's take a look around the back here. And so apparently the adjuster came out and said that there was water, that the water came in through the door here. And the next, I guess it was a day or two later, after a really, really heavy rain, it rained again and there was more water coming in. This was all dry and there was water coming in by that bathroom. And so this is what we're looking at in the backyard. So what do you all think? I'm going to freeze it right here and this is the area where that bathroom is where the leaking was coming in on the inside so take a look right there right away what i'm seeing a couple things first of all we have the old style gutter guard here which doesn't really work too well we have these lines of black wet goop that indicate that the gutters have overflowed. We have a huge long run of gutter with only one downspout. We also have a huge long run of gutter on this on the second story, which the water probably overflowed from the first one and overflowed in this corner here. So this corner is a really, really smoking gun that we have a problem here. Look at where the water's overflowed here, the gutters. And We've got a corrugated pipe here. And I just messed with this and it's full of ice. So my guess would be that water overflowed here, overflowed from the gutters. And once water lands right here, it has no way to get out of here. And so it's gonna go down. A Couple other indications that there's been water here. Look at the rot right there. And so I'm gonna tell the homeowner that we need to put new gutters on this thing. We need to add a downspout. Let's see, add a downspout here and add a downspout here. Catch these two gutters and pipe them wherever this corrugated is going, which the corrugated is out here. And you can see how it goes up and down. It does look like it had flowed a little bit, but you know how this stuff doesn't really keep up too well. So that is going to be my assessment. That corrugated or that downspout might have something to do with it too. But yeah, what do you all think? The other thing I wanted to mention was gravel up against the foundation. Now this is a slab right here where the garage is, but we have a ton of organic matter. And you can see, look at this, look at this debris dam right here. You can see where the water's been flowing right up against the foundation. It's all frozen right now because it's been cold. But we also have lots of water damage along the siding right there. And you can see all the fines got washed up here. And so I definitely feel like there's a lot of water hanging up against the foundation. And it probably wouldn't even hurt to, to pack in some dirt back there and try to grade it. But that's real tough with the siding being so low. So if we can get the gutter water and the roof water out of there, I think that will cut it. I think that'll do it. So pretty interesting one. And the homeowners have been battling, trying to get the thing dried out for a little over a week now. A little bit more information. We had had about maybe five or six inches of rain over a day and it was really, really, really wet. I've been getting calls all over the place but they had that flooding going on and I guess it hadn't happened except for that really heavy rain. And so 
just really quickly ruled out any kind of plumbing problem because it happened during the rain and then it stopped. And it was a pretty bad situation there in the basement with all that water in there. And then, like I said in the video, a few, like maybe four days later, we had another substantially substantial rain, but it wasn't quite as bad and it flooded again. And so that's where they were able to see that the water was not coming in through that side garage door and flowing all the way across the garage and into the basement, that it was actually coming through the wall where I, I showed you that arrow. And so that's a pretty good indication of where the water was coming from. And so going out on the outside of the house and seeing the gutter situation, seeing that blind corner where there was no way for the water to get out, seeing the water damage, seeing that corrugated pipe, seeing those really long runs of gutter with only one downspout, all that is, is makes it pretty obvious and pretty clear that water getting into that blind corner has no way to get out and it just goes down into the foundation. And so I'm going to recommend new gutters and piping those downspouts out away from it. And then that'll be, that'll be a, that this will, that'll probably solve everything forever. But I'll also give them an option of replacing that gravel and stepping stone walkway with concrete and do the concrete all the way up against the foundation. That way we can slope it away from the foundation and form a, a waterproof barrier up against the foundation. So that'll be kind of a, if you want to go to extreme and really protect this thing, we can do that as well. So that's what that's my assessment for this job and this this issue so what do you all think of that one let me know in the comments and thanks for watching i hope you all have enjoyed this assessment and let me know in the comments if you came to the same conclusions i did also let me know if you'd like to see more assessment videos and you can find links to support the channel in the description thanks again and i will see you on the next one